Hello and welcome to the how-to series presented by Fresh Service, your guide to the best practices for ITSM and ITOM. I'm Niharika and I'm here to share with you on how to manage your SaaS applications in Fresh Service. In today's session, we will be taking you through the major challenges that we see with SaaS adoption and how Fresh Service is tackling this with its SaaS management solution. So let's begin with acknowledging the fact that SaaS is the future. That's quite a bold and a broad statement to make about SaaS adoption, but we do have some data to back it up. So to give you a slice of how SaaS adoption is today, we see on an average about $3,000 being spent per employee on SaaS subscriptions. About 288 apps on an average are used by enterprises to solve their business problems. Now this is about the present. A projection about the future is that about 73% of organizations say nearly all their apps will be SaaS by 2021. All this clearly points that digital transformation is pacing up and with the remote way of taking over, switching to SaaS solutions is inevitable. So what is the impact of this accelerated SaaS adoption? How companies evaluate, purchase and manage software has changed with SaaS. If employees have a business problem to solve, either for themselves or for their teams, they can quickly browse for solutions that fit their needs. And not just that, purchasing these tools has also become easy. They do not really need the IT team's help to purchase it. All they need is a credit card, they can swipe it and purchase licenses for their teams. Implementation of SaaS tools has also become incredibly easy. They do not really need the IT team's help here as well. Every SaaS tool today has end-to-end -end documentation and 24-7 support, which makes implementation a breeze for every person who wants to adopt it. With SaaS adoption, we see increased independence in purchasing and implementing SaaS apps. Of course, this is a great innovative spirit that we see with digital transformation. But the downside of this is when you look at it with an enterprise-wide lens. Such decision starts becoming more siloed as every team and every employee can start implementing their own tools for their business needs. So when the IT teams try to implement some security standards in place, or when they try to understand how much of an investment is going into such SaaS applications, it becomes quite impossible for them to understand this as these decisions do not go via the IT teams. Sometimes the same business problem might be solved with different tools across teams. Now, these are the challenges that are cropping up with the increased SaaS adoption. But again, this is falling into the IT team's responsibility to streamline and manage. But the problems that IT teams face is that traditional software asset management tools were never built for managing SaaS. The current processes and tools in place to discover and manage software does not really scale with SaaS applications. And therefore, as IT teams do not have a tool which is giving them a bird's eye view of what is happening with respect to SaaS adoption, they face these three key challenges. Number one is the lack of visibility. They do not really know what apps are being used in the organization and who is using them. And the next is understanding app usage. They cannot really understand how frequently the apps are being used. This is critical information when it comes to making business decisions like deprovisioning users or downgrading users or even offboarding employees when they leave the company. Finally, it is quite difficult for the IT teams to stay on top of renewals and payments as again, this is completely out of their view. So this is why we put together five steps to manage SaaS applications efficiently using Fresh Service. Using the SaaS management solution, you can get a single pane of glass of all the applications that are currently used in your organization, and you can analyze and optimize usage at ease. So let's get started. Step one, discover your SaaS applications. We offer a suite of integrations for you to gain complete visibility into all the applications that are in use in your organization. So to first spot all these integrations that are available for you to get started with, Go to your admin settings in Fresh Service and click on SaaS management here. And here you can see that we offer 
two different kinds of integrations. The first one being integrations with identity providers like Azure, Google Suite, Okta, and so on. And the second kind of integrations that we offer are direct integrations with SaaS applications like Zoom and Slack. So to understand better as to how these integrations work, let's quickly switch to the software tab under assets. So here you can see all the applications that were discovered using SaaS management. And here you can see something called the source, right? So here you can see some identity providers like Okta and Google Suite. So when you integrate with an identity provider, all the SaaS applications that were authenticated using these identity providers will get discovered into fresh service. So this is about the first kind of integrations. The second one, that is direct integrations with applications like Zoom and Slack, offers you much more granular information about the usage. So let's quickly see how the Zoom integration looks like. So here you can see very granular usage activity and you can also understand license utilization. That is how many available licenses you have with respect to a Zoom enterprise subscription and the number of users who are currently using it. And you also have some specific plan-based metrics here. That is, since you're directly integrating with Zoom, all the plans specific to Zoom gets populated here and you can understand the usage based on these plans. So this is the benefit of integrating directly with some of the SaaS applications that we offer as a part of our suite of integrations. And one more interesting thing to note is that you can see that we also have something called categories in place for all the SaaS applications that were discovered. So we have an inbuilt and a growing repository of thousand plus apps which auto categorizes all the SaaS applications that are discovered using these identity providers. So what we are essentially doing is all the SaaS applications that are discovered when you integrate with an identity provider might be solving multiple business problems, right? So, but to understand what exactly they're solving for, we use this inbuilt repository to categorize them, such as project management apps, expense management apps, and so on. So all you have to do is look up any category that you want like let's say project management and you can see that there are two apps currently in use for the same business problem. So now you can start making business decisions like either consolidating these apps together or deploying another solution in place for the entire enterprise to solve the same business problem. Next step two, track and analyze usage. So with the deep insights that we offer, for all the applications that you discover in Fresh Service, you can identify redundant and underutilized SaaS apps. So to access these insights in your software tab, click on insights here. So you can see different kinds of insights that you can stay on top of. To begin with, we first have operational insights. Using these insights, you can understand how you can manage your SaaS applications better in Fresh Service. We notify you about no licenses or no users assigned to these apps. When it comes to compliance insights, we notify you about deactivated users. So let's say an employee leaves your organization and you've offboarded them by deactivating this user on fresh service. But there are chances that these users are still having access to one of your SaaS tools. So you can stay on top of such data from compliance insights. So here you can clearly see some deactivated users who are currently assigned to some of your SaaS tools. Finally, when it comes to usage insights, you can stay on top of low usage or you can also understand if certain apps have not been used by users for an extended period of time. So here you can uh, see that for this particular tool, there are about 23 users who have not been using it for a long time. There is no activity users. And we also tell you that you can save about $4,000 annually by removing them. So with such insights, you can do two things. One, you can optimize usage. And two, you can stay on top of and cut down your SaaS spend. Moving to step three, take insight driven actions. So when you look at such deep insights about your SaaS applications, you would also want to act upon them by making some business decisions. So we enable you to take such actions to optimize SaaS spend and usage 
right from fresh service. So when you see any of these insights here, they're completely actionable. So let's say you see a tool with no licenses in place. You just have to click on it and create a new contract from there. Now let's say you have a compliance insight. So here you can see Zoom has one deactivated user who you would have to deprovision. So click on this data and you can see the deactivated user here. Click on the user and select take action. So from here, you can choose the action that you want to perform on this user's access to the tool. So you can either deprovision the user or you can notify about low usage and so on. So in this case, we have to deprovision the user as it is a deactivated employee. So click on deprovision user and initiate action. And you can see that we create service requests for this action to ensure that they are routed to the right teams to be resolved. Finally, when it comes to usage insights, that is, for this particular tool, you can see about 23 users who are not actively using it at all. And when you also see that you can save about $4,000, you would definitely want to deprovision all these users and save the SaaS costs. So click on this and select the users you want to deprovision. And click on take action and you can select the action that you want to perform. Moving on to step four, then you intelligently. So you can streamline and manage all your SaaS subscriptions and renewals right within Fresh Service. So within every application under the licenses tab, you can manage all the software licenses for the SaaS applications. You can click on create new contract and add all the details required for that particular application's license and add in the tenure for the contract. So this is where you can enable two key features for the contract. You can enable auto renewals for these contracts so that they renew automatically when the expiry date is reached. You can also enable notifications for these renewals and choose the number of days before which you want a notification and the person who should be notified about this renewal. So this is largely about how you can manage licenses for every one of your SaaS applications. But what exactly is the intelligent factor in this, right? So this is where our insights come into the picture. So our usage insights are curated in such a way that they take into account the usage data from the last 60 days of your app usage. And these are notified to you 45 days before your apps are renewed. So let's say, for example, this tool has about 23 users who are not actively using it. Now, this is notified to you only when this particular tool's license is up for renewal in the next 45 days. So what you can do is you can quickly ensure that these 23 users are downgraded or deprovisioned and you can renew your next batch of subscriptions with the right licenses in place. So this is how you can ensure that your renewals are done in an intelligent manner. Now moving to the final step, that is step five, offboard confidently. So now that you have complete visibility into all the SaaS applications that are used in your organization, you can also ensure that you offboard your employees right by revoking all the accesses that they have to the SaaS applications. So to do this, there are two things that you can stay on top of. One is the compliance insights. So here you can see all the deactivated users assigned to SaaS applications and ensure that they are deprovisioned when the employees leave the organization. Or you can go to the admin tab. And if your employee is either a requester or an agent, go into the respective admin settings here and click on their profile. So here under software, you can see the different SaaS applications that they have access to, and you can quickly revoke accesses from here. So this is how you can offboard your employees confidently by staying on top of all the SaaS applications that your employees use. So that brings us to the end of the five steps that we recommend to manage your SaaS applications efficiently in Fresh Service. SaaS management module is available for Fresh Service customers in pro and enterprise plans. So go ahead and give it a try. Thank you for taking the time today. Do sign up 
for a 21-day free trial and try fresh service now using the link shown here.